Hey guys, and welcome back to Surviving Mars, where, funnily enough, we are doing our best to survive Mars. Last time we got ourselves a situation where we had people. People came along and we managed to get through the entire 10-day stint to show that we are worthy of holding on to colonists. We made ourselves a nice little, um, what are we going to call this, power station over here, power and water, of course. We need to get some polymers down here, but that is something to think about. Today's mission is to get all the secondary considerations done. So you can see here we've got polymers that are being made. Uh, we are also collecting metals over here and rare metal extractor. Yeah, we're, we're, I keep wanting to call it the rare earth elements, but we're on Mars. So is it the rare rare Mars elephant? Uh, elephants. Rare, rare Mars elephants. You heard it here first. That's what that machine does. Uh, but we need to do some processing. Need to uh, move these things on to other things because if we have a look inside our resources here, you can see we're, we're starting to run out of um, machine parts. We're doing all right for polymers, but then we have a polymer factory, so that's okay. But machine parts and electronics, big problems here. Thankfully, if I come in and go to my production, we've got an electronics factory. Crazy. Almost as if I had planned for this when we first started. We're going to do it that way around. Machine parts low. Okay, so if we're running out of machine parts, let's also that do it can. like this. And I'd kind of like to leave this open for some sort of food production facility or something like that if we can. But in the meantime, we're going to come across, we're going to have a look just at our passenger snapped. rocket. No, no we're not. Because there is something that a, a colonist has just snapped. Cody Griffins, as every other colonist, went through a psychological dis conditioning before arriving on Mars to guarantee the most basic ability to cope with the adverse environment. Oh dear. So he's having troubles. Let, let's have a look. Dude, stop. Stop. What's wrong, man? What's wrong? Let's, let's talk. Why, why are you having troubles? Now, somewhere, set residence. No, somewhere there's a readout to be able to, like, figure out what's going wrong with this guy. Sanity is down. Okay, let's have a look at that. Uh, he gets well rested for five, but then works outside the dome for minus ten. So we need to try and figure out some way of chilling him out for that. But I think at the moment we're kind of doing all right having a couple of geologists on the go. Let's have a look. We've got, um, oh man, we got scientists. Scientists are supposed to be working in here. Why? Why haven't we got scientists working in there? Let's uh, let's hopefully, if we can, have a look at our entire colony overview traits. Let's have a look. Specializations. We've got botanists and scientists. Is that all we've got? So we need to send out a cry. A cry to the many masses waiting at Earth. Because we need to get... We've got botanists. We've got... Um, we've got engineers. No, sorry. We've got scientists. So we need engineers and geologists. These are the two things we need. So let's go do that. Engineers and geologists. We're going to go passenger rocket. I'm literally going to go specialization, get rid of all of these and go, hey, I don't want any other than scientists, engineers, geologists. Okay, there we go. We're probably going to need more, more engineers. Let's, let's let the no specializations in and see what we can do with that. So let's go back and have a look at the other things that we are being restrictive of. I don't mind if we have middle-aged people. That's, that's fine. We'll go with that. Uh, specialization we've done. Uh, gender, don't care. Do not care. Do not care at all. Uh, don't care about whether we have religious or not, If as long as they make their way in. Uh, is there any here being restricted that shouldn't be? No, I think we're doing all right. I think we're doing all right. The, the religious are okay. Now, floors. Floors are always an issue, but I'm just going to leave them as they are. And quirks. Have we got a no anywhere? We've got no tourists. Doesn't work. Leaves at the first opportunity. We'll decide to stay with comfort is high plus gambling. Uh, no, we're all right with that. We're all right. And I don't care one way or the other with the vegans. So let's review here. We've got a couple of no specializations, but we, we do have a, a workaholic, but also an alcoholic. Not, not the best. I'd, I'd rather not have uh, alcoholics with me. So let's start with this engineer. Hypochondriac needs to go and see a medical facility at some point. That's fine. Um, we'll take a geologist with us as well. Here's another couple of geologists. Party animal. Uh, lazy. Do I want to take a lazy person with me? We're, we're going to take them for now because they're quite important. I'm uh, seeing a distinct lack of engineers. I mean, this guy is a gambler and this one is an alcoholic. I mean, this, this is going to be tough. This is actually going to be tough. So how many engineers? Engineers do we have there? One, two, three. Is that it? Three. One. Two, three. Uh, I've got a lot of places that need people. So let's try and find workaholic um, non specialization people because we're going to make them work hard. Indeed, we are. Vegan, nerd, hypochondriac, workaholic. Here we'll go with that. Uh, maybe we want to get ourselves a. Let's go back can i now change i bet as soon as i change something it's going to be like nope we're going to completely read it we've only got one medic that could possibly come 
Mm, I, I would really like them to go in there, though, if we can. Let's review again. Has it changed everything? It's changed everything. How dare you, sirs? How dare you? Okay, so let's just let's just take the, the, the top, the bright, the special, the best. Uh, there, there. The, a couple of those. Uh, we, where is that medic? I really could do with a medic. Uh, is that more engineers now? Have we got... No, it's still only one engineer at the top. So it's three geologists, three engineers. Uh, we could probably do with some more geologists and then a bunch of non-specialized. So let's try with that. Let's have a look down. There's another geologist and there's another geologist. So that's like five geologists. That, that'll that do. Let's now fill up on non-specialized. I, I really don't know whether I want to have the alcoholic with us. Oh, well, we'll, we'll, we'll go with it. We'll, we'll go with it. Uh, vegan nerd hypochondriac. I'll, I'll take these until we're done. Okay, cool. Launch. Do we have medical facilities here? This is a question. This is a question. Uh, we do not appear to, though we could probably... No, no I don't think this is going to work for the medical reasons. Ah, I, there's, a, there's, a, there's a gap somewhere. There's the gap. Look, right back here. Bam. Okay. Where are we going to put medical facilities? I might even end up removing something. We'll remove something. Uh, or we put more food in. Yeah, that, that might actually be a winner there. We'll put more food in. Oh, look, I've got a bunch of moisture evaporators that we can use. We've got these all plugged next to each other, and they're obviously not making the best use of uh, water there. I think we'll be fine. I think, my dude over here, you, Mr. Transport, hey, can you pick up some stuff for me? I want you to pick up a couple of polymers. It's literally just a couple, if you could. Um, am I watching this one? Two. Okay, cool. Uh, and then I would like you to bring it all the way over to our water system over here. I just want you to actually offload right there. Um, if you could do that, offloading at target coordinates. Thank you very much. Looking pretty good. Wow, look at this place. Just look at this place. We're expanding out over here. Are we looking to put a new dome down? That looks like something that we might be doing. But talking of domes, this place has not been named. I mean, that... Oh, look, we've got different... Oh, look at this. Okay, so let's let's try this skin. Yeah, yeah, love it. Okay, so we're going to look it like that. But this place has not been named, and, and, and I feel like we're going to name it. I'm going to make call it the Isai... Isai, it, it's for the Japanese word of one, itch. Um, but Isai, it means first generation. It's actually a reference to Kin Stanley Robinson's Red Mars. It's the name of the first hundred that get dropped down. So we're going to call it, well, it should be it, it's the habitat, right? Uh, let's, let's call it Hab. I, Isai? Hab? We're going to go with Isai. Uh, obviously, this is a word that I've only ever read before. I've not I've not had anybody actually tell, explain to me how it's supposed to be working, but that, that's looking good. Uh, average, colony is, uh, average colony sanity is 47, obviously being brought down uh, by the geologists out there, but we should hopefully, by giving people their specialisation to work in, be able to deal with that. Come on, little dude. I believe in you. It's, I know it's a long way to go, but I, I think we're going to be able to get this power store set up, and then everybody will be a-okay. We've got a little metal metal depo deposit there. Uh, are you able to go around and do anything with that? Like, if we bring you down here... Wheel moving. You see there's a little metal node there, and I think it'd be good to pop it over that way. Uh, we, we could really do with having some sort of setup over here. I'm just looking around and seeing if there's anything else in particular that we need. But whilst we're here, let's get ourselves a couple of scans going down. That's not my dude. Where are you, my dude? And we're going to assume you're over here somewhere. Hello? Someone travelling? What are you? You are RC Rover 2. That's cool. All right, let's double click and see where you are. Oh, you're all the way up there. You also look like you're about to die. So, I mean, run out of power. I mean, de death is a bit relative to uh, to drones, right? Okay, let's pop that there like so. Also, we've got our polymers going down. So hopefully these guys will come along and fix this. Now, is this going to be a thing where it's like always polymers? Yeah, okay. Uh, so let's set up... Do I want to set up a small polymer store? Is that something I can do? Storage, polymer depot. Oh, I'm not sure if I want to do... Like, I kind of want to do half size, if at all possible. I mean, the 180 is a lot. Is a lot. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to be like, hey, can we come over... Create an automatic transport note so that, so that resource will be collected near the origin point and delivered to destination. Active until all sources are exhausted or is there no more room in the destination? See, that's a lot of polymers to take over. You know what I'm saying? Maybe what we should have done... Has put down a universal one with nothing but polymers active. 
Yeah, let's try that. All right, okay, let's salvage this. That that that's a thing. It's a bit of a weird way of doing it, but we're gonna we're gonna work this out live on camera. Gonna figure it out together. Uh, so hopefully down here I should have a universal depot, and we can do one of those. And then I don't want anything other than polymers. <clears throat> Excuse me, nothing other than a polymers. If we could, okay, that's good. And then up here, uh, nothing other than metals. Let's get rid of those. All right, that means then this can disappear as well and then we'll set up this guy where are you you over here we're going to set you up on a delivery run okay load resource i want on the universal pallet over here if at all possible let's go with that one uh oh can i not do two that's that's a little bit of a shout. Okay, let, let's let's cancel that. We're gonna go pick up from polymer station there, and we're gonna unload all the way over here, and that should hopefully do the do the business. Oh no, that's un man. I clicked the wrong button. So load resource. Let's do let's do it all over again. Let's just make sure we know what we're doing. Okay, so we're gonna load polymers, and then we're gonna. <coughs> As I was saying, we're going to load polymers, and then we're going to come all the way over here, too used to clicking the unload button now, uh, to go unload over there. Alright, away you go, buddy. Away you go. Right, are you fully charged yet? You're not fully charged, but that's because we're at night, which means this has got no power either. A little bit of a shame. We'll just wait our time, though. Uh, whilst we're doing that, let's speed up time and get things moving a little bit more quickly now that we are set up and ready to go. Uh, I think everything's looking pretty good. Pretty good. We've got three buildings not working uh, those are the two concrete factories and that water that is totally fine that water because we didn't didn't run the power down that's all fine it's got its own little stand uh, its own little contained power system are you actually gonna do anything here you're just powering up but are you waiting for anything to actually get made I don't know I don't know man we could really do with more engineers even after the influx comes in we're, we're still gonna be having the troubles so is this now actually doing the thing or is it just saying hey I'm doing the back Tree, so I'm not going to do any more. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe we should have gone from here. Let's try. Let's try it. We're going to go from you polymers all the way over. Let's zoom out a bit so we get a faster map travel over there. Let's let's see if that works. That that should work. I'm hoping that works. Okay, there we go. All the polym from from everywhere. We're taking all the polymers. Wow. Okay, it's not quite what I wanted, but it will do. Yeah, okay, okay. I'll, I'll live with this. I'll, this is literally just to maintain this area, this this little bit here. That's that's crazy, because it, it only takes one polymer every however long. Uh, so that's a thing. Right, you, have you powered up? You have powered up. I'd like you to come over and start researching these anomalies, because, man, we, we need the research. We really do need the research. Uh, the rocket is ready to come down. What is the rocket today? Is this Asimov or Clark? I cannot see. We're going to put you down over here. It says overlap deposit, uh, but one of those, is, that's a deep deposit. I don't think I really care. I don't think I really care. I'd like some sort of pathway leading from the gate to the to the rocket. I think that'd be a good idea. If we, if we could get that running, that'd be pretty good. All right, let's have a quick look at our tech here. Oh man, we are running ahead, but we've also got everything all queued up, so I'm not really that worried about it. Rover Command AI means our rovers don't need... Uh, more importantly, our drone commanding rover doesn't need recharging. Should really get around to making that drone hub as well at some point. We've got the drone printing has been done. What's this down here? Scientists and botanists have a plus 10 on their work performance. I mean, I'd like to get the engineers and geologists as well at some point. Crowdfunding live from Mars. Martian Educational. Mars University. Trained scientists, geologists and botanists. Ah, oh, so train anybody up. That's pretty good. General training, colonists without proper specialization suffer a lower work penalty. That would be one to bear in mind at some point. Battery optimization and machine printing. The, these machine printings and stuff, they're very important. What is this? Martian aerodynamics, robotics, shuttle speed increased by 30%. I haven't, I haven't got shuttles. I have not got shuttles. Okay, so these guys should be now plowing out. There we go. Look at them all. Look at them all. Are they actually in spacesuits here? Let's have a look. Hi, brave citizen of Mars, ready to attain the final frontier. Um, Iva Dimitriov, uh, Dimitriova? Something like that. We can rename them. So that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I've got a lot of colonists here, so uh, if you fancy a name, 
put your names in the comments below and maybe we'll do something about that because uh, we got a lot of them. We got a lot of them. And don't forget, if you are a named colonist, I'll try and drive you insane first. <laughs> All right, let's come over here and see what's going on. Might be on the verge of a new golden age. Huzzah! And we we have, have to be the ones who ride the crest of that wave. Yeah, indeed. A new era of scientific discovery is ahead of us and we are the ones who are blessed. Okay, we have 40 technologies research. Oh, go have 40 technologies research at Soul 100. Are you kidding? We, we currently have 12. Oh, man. Oh, I'm, I'm, I, ain't, I ain't sure about that, guys. 40 by day 100. I mean, we're, we're already day 30. We've only got... Oh man, no, this is this this is not gonna be the easiest. <laughs> it's not gonna be the easiest at all. Looks like we need to make an entire research dome just for researching. Mmm. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be fun. Now do we have engineers we in both of these? Alright, cool. So we are actually making 1.7 uh machine parts and 1.1 electronics per day. We've got these guys turning over. I'm hoping like you see this scientist here? Um no, no, let's, let's try that again. This scientist, you, should work. Hit, no, no. Uh, research lab, why, why aren't people working here? Hmm, priorities are a little bit weird. How do I make sure that people who are in the wrong place, you, go here? Okay, did that, is that right? Is that right? Okay, that should be right. We should have enough geologists here. Botanist, botanist, botanist is what I'm trying to say, actually. No specialization and no specialization. That's good. What about over here? Have we got any botanists or anything? Look, you're in the wrong place. Let's put you back in the farm. We, we need to have as many botanists in the farm as possible. If we don't have the botanists in the farm, we're going to have a troubles. Okay, so you're both a lazy and wrong, wrong workplace, but can you work over there for the next Sector however long? Scan. Thank you. What was that? Sector scanned. Uh, engineer, scientist, wrong workplace specialization. Go over there. Thank you. Uh, and you are scientist. <coughs> scientist. Can you go over there? All right. Brilliant. That should stop everyone who's not supposed to be working. Look at this. Geologist and botanist. So we want the botanist. You need to work over here. And geologist. No, you're an engineer. Geologist. You need to work up there okay cool this is going to be a long time of just balancing people out and finding out where they're supposed to be working right i know we didn't bring that many engineers with us but cable fault reported cable fault reported how dare you how dare you where where i mean it's right by us we should have this fixed up look look at that drones at it already look at you little little dancey drone <laughs> Yeah? No? All right, let's move on. Um, Rover Command AI is a thing, so that means we've got another slot ready to go. Uh, we need to start working on that one. As I said, geologists and scientists need to have... Uh, engineers, sorry, need to have a little bit more uh, stuff to do. Oh, look, we haven't done the salvage protocol. We'll have, we have to make sure we do that at some point, as well as all these up here. Maybe we should do these low-hanging fruit at the bottom of the queue uh, whilst we're trying to get this... Hun uh, was it 40 technologies by day 100? It's gonna be it's gonna be awkward. It's gonna be awkward. Uh, I don't want that up there. Someone's having a freak out. Let's see who you are, Cody Griffin. You're probably just like chilling out now, right? Yeah. Is that we gotta build a thing that enables him to be better chilled? Let's see, he's crowd party animal, gains additional comfort. I don't I want sanity. Double sanity loss from disasters. No, one of the first founders and is lazy. So I don't know how to how to reinvigorate sanity. Anybody out there got any ideas? Lowered lower by working on a heavy workload. Lowered by working on a heavy workload in outside oh lowered okay sorry i was like what what no but it's we want to raise sanity uh in outside buildings and during dark hours witnessing the death of colonists living in the same residence or various martian disasters recovered when resting at home or by visiting certain service buildings all right certain service buildings let's work towards that shall we uh, i i don't know what can, can i get rid of this menu please thank you i don't know which one we're gonna go with dome services space bar maybe is that is that what we want? Um, service comfort sixty. I, I'm not after. I'm after sanity. Is comfort and sanity tied in together? Security station counters crime by renegades and reduces sanity loss from disaster. To be a pioneer of the Martian frontier, 
or at least uh, it should. What? They face uncertainty, which no. Cody Griffin's, on the other hand, uh, a pilot, doesn't seem especially brave. This this is the same guy as the coward trait. Which means he's going to suffer when disasters happen. That's that's fine. That's fine. We can live with that. Uh, this guy is on his way back. Hi. Um, you need to stop now. Just just get some get some power, man. Get some power. Hopefully, this is now a. Re oh, no, look at this. What is this? What is this? Polymers on the floor. I am not down for that. Come and pick these up, and then we will fill this place up with with with. Metal? Somehow? There's got to be metal around somewhere. Oh, am I still not in the right place? No, I'm not. Okay, you come down here. Okay, that should make everything better. And then you can come down and unlock this technology. Thanks. Uh, then we need to take him back and do these. These two little anomalies here are definitely going to win us some points. Wow, already we are 20 minutes through the episode. And I am loving what's going on here. We have built ourselves... Ooh, auto save. Come on, let's get on with it. We have built ourselves a machine parts factory with a people working in here. It's quite hard to try and get the right people working in here, it turns out. Engineer. Well, I don't I don't need this many electronics people, you know? Uh, what's going on out here? The, these are more important. Having ourselves the actual geologist doing the business is far more important out here. You're a geologist and you're a geologist. What, what else have we got going in here? Uh, engineer, no specialization, no specialization. Botanist, it's, it's just moving the botanists around. That seems to be the problem. Uh, can we just up, up the... Ah, this is why. Maybe we can get a second... Can I not get a second going? No, okay. So I want to... I wanna... We'll turn these on. Toggle current on, on. No, it doesn't seem to want to do the work for me. I brought a lot of botanists so I could do this. And why won't it turn on? 16, 4, 14, 22, 22. So I don't want that. Definitely don't want that. But I I do, I do want this on for another one. Let's get rid of that wheat grass. Um, don't know what to do. Don't know what to do. Obviously, we're not going to be able to get this working here. Um, hmm. Let's try clicking that. No, already did that. Already did that. Okay, so we're going to have to stop with that for now. Let's see how we're doing on this. We are still making... It's not as many as it was, but there are inactive work shifts. I'd like to fix that. I really would. So these are pauses, not... So why is this one full-on uh, only needs one? You see how this is a tick and a cross, whereas this is a tick and a pause button. I'm not sure what's going on there. I'm not sure what's going on there. But I think with that, I am going to say thank you very much for joining for this adventure, ladies and gentlemen. Today we have, as I say, sorted out production and made ourselves nice and self-reliant on little things like machine parts, polymers, and electronics. Next time we'll be going around and doing our best to try and make sure we get these 40 research by Soul 100. Did we save up enough power to actually keep this running overnight here? Here is the question. We're discharging five at a time. Now, it looks like we might actually have a little bit of trouble there but i'm not gonna lose my mind about it we will definitely try and deal with that next time but i'll see you then when we're gonna do that bye